Hello guys, today I will be um, rating some aeroplanes, so um, let's start. Okay, so the first plane we're going to be looking at is the Airbus A320, which I have flown on twice before actually. I've flown with British Airways and um, EasyJet, so let's have a look. So yeah, I overall, I like the nose, yeah. It looks quite nice. Um, yeah, I like it in the Airbus livery. I mean, I wish I had tilted landing gear, go gear though. <laughs> that one, that would look better. Um, yeah, so I'll rate it a. I'll give it a eight out of ten. Yeah, I like it. Okay, so now we'll be looking at the Airbus A three twenty one. So the first looks. It looks a lot like the A three twenty. I think. Um, the engines are different, and yeah, um, so overall I think I'd rate it a 9.5 out of 10. Oh look, there's a Neo. Okay, next up is the A330. So, um, well, <laughs> I mean, the noise is, the nose, sorry, is very pointy. I'm not, I know there's a Neo. Not a huge fan of it, I mean... It's alright. I think I prefer the A321, so I'll give it a 6 out of 10. Final rating. Okay, so next up is the Airbus A350. So I chose specifically Qatar for this one because I really like the livery. I think it looks really cool and it really suits the um, A350. So there's the A351, A351000, sorry. Um, yeah, I like, I really like the windows, the cockpit windows, and I'll... I like the curved. Anyway, so I'll rate it a 8 out of 10. Final rating. Okay, now it's time for the last Airbus aircraft. We'll be rating the Airbus A380. So, um, it's very big. I like the four engines with the Trent 900s, if I'm not mistaken. Not on the Emirates, though. So, yeah, overall, it's all right. Um, so I will give it a 7.9 out of 10. Yep. Okay, now it's the first Boeing plane which we'll be doing is the 737-800. So, I like it. I've been on the Dash 800 the most. I really I like the pointy nose and they've been around for quite a while. So, yeah, I like it. Um, Very popular. I'll give it a 7 out of 10. Okay, so now it's time for the Queen of the Skies, a.k.a. the... Well, all the way around the 747-400, so... Yes, I really do like this one. It's one of my favourite aircraft. Um, yeah, I have the pointy nose and the hump is so iconic. And I really do like it. <laughs> what is that? Um, <laughs> yeah, so overall, I really like this aircraft, especially in the British Airways livery. And I will give it a 9.5 out of 10. Okay, now it's time for the 757-200, which is also known as the Flying Pencil. So, um, it's all right. Um, it looks similar to the A321's nose, in my opinion. Um, the engines, if I'm not mistaken, are the RB211s. Yep. Um, it's okay. Um, overall, I don't really like it too much, so I'll give it a 6 out of 10. Now I'll be looking at the 767-300ER, so, yeah, I do like it. Um, it's quite nice. It's very similar to the 757 in terms of the cockpit, and it was made around the same time, so... Yeah, I really like it, but I'm looking for the 2E livery, actually. Um, I've always wanted to fly the 767 with 2E. So let's see. Yes, there it is. It looks really good in the 2E livery. So overall, I'll give it a... I'll give it an 8 out of 10. Yes, I really like the 767. How I think about it, I went in a 757 a few weeks ago, actually, from um, Birmingham to Naples and back. Yeah, it wasn't too great. I didn't really like it. <clears throat> I prefer the 737 because two we do operate the 737. Okay, now it's time for the 777-300ER. So, yeah, it's a very big plane, the G90s, which are the biggest um, engines, if I'm not mistaken. So, yeah, I do like it. It's a very big, wide-body aircraft, so I'll rate it um, a 7 out of 10, yeah. 
And now it's time for the last aircraft of the day, the 787 Dreamliner. So I've chose the Dash 9 variant for this one. I do like it. Um, it looks very modern. I like the engines. Um, yeah, I like the little tan delivery. I like the cockpit windows as well. I like the nose shape and yeah. Overall, it's a nice aircraft. So I'll give it a 8.5 out of 10. Final rating, yeah. Okay, so that's all for now. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.